Hey guys, so today in this video I'm going to be showing you how to do a handwriting animation in DaVinci Resolve 15, just like this one. Now in today's video you're either going to need an iPhone, a tablet or an iPad that has a notepad on it that allows you to write with your finger, because that is how we're going to make the animation for today's video. Now with that said, let's get straight into the tutorial. Okay, so first of all go into your notepad or on your phone or your tablet or your iPad or whatever and then start screen recording. Now this is how we're going to make the animation. Now we'll just go into the handwriting section, go into, uh, I recommend quite a thick uh, font, and go into whatever colour you want. And then start writing out what you want to say in your animation. So mine is just going to say the date, which is the 11th of the 4th, 2019. And there we have the animation that we're going to use for this video. And now you can stop screen recording. Now you're going to need to somehow import that footage onto your computer. Now if you have an iPhone and you have like a MacBook, you can just use AirDrop. You can also, if you have a micro SD card in your phone, you can uh, just put the clip onto your micro SD card and then import onto your computer. If you have, uh, you can use Dropbox, you can put it on just a Google Drive and then download it onto your computer. But anyway, you need to find some way of moving the screen recording of your animation onto your computer somehow. Now, because I'm using a micro, uh, micro SD card, I'm just gonna move onto my micro SD card and then import it onto my computer. Okay, so now we are in DaVinci Resolve 15 and here in my timeline at, at the top here we have the screen recording of my animation that we just did, which is here. And then at the bottom here we just have a time lapse of my editing, which I'm going to put the animation on top of. Okay, so before we go onto the color tab and qualify this, we need to just uh, change it around a bit so it actually like fits the screen and also is rotated properly. So we go up into the inspector, we need to change the rotation of this to 90 degrees. So select this and just put 90 degrees there, and that puts it in sideways. And then we're just going to change the size of this to be bigger and like fill up the screen more. And there we have um, the animation here. But we want to get rid of this like white bit out here, the, the actual, the screen recording that isn't the animation that we have. So we go into the color tab, go, then, then go into the nodes page and right click, then go into add alpha output, out, out, output and then collect, uh, select those together. Okay, so first of all, we're going to add a power window. Now this is just, we're gonna select the area of the animation that we want to qualify. So if we just go in here, then go into add a polygon. And now we're just gonna put this around to the shape of the final animation, which is, if we just go back to like around here. So that it, that is what the final animation looks like. And we're just gonna put this to be the same like shape as it. Now we need to qualify this so we don't have the white background on it. Go into the, so we go into the qualifier, then go up here, select qualifier, and then just select the white bit. Now as you can see here, it has selected the white bit and it's got rid of everything that isn't the white bit, which is not what we want. We want to have it so it uh, keeps the blue bit and gets rid of the white bit. So we go over here and go on to invert and that inverts it so we can see the blue bit and it has got rid of as much white as possible. But as you can see here, there's still some bits of white that goes around the edges. So to fix that, we can go onto these settings here and have a little fiddle around with these to get rid of as much white as possible. Uh, it's not working that well. So we need to go onto the qualifier and go onto the add qualifier, which is over here. Now this allows us to select different colors and different shades of the color to add more to the qualifier. So we can just add more of this white that we have here. You can hold down on the reel uh, to like drag around your clip and zoom in using the reel. And then just select all of the white bits that we don't want. So I think that's what I think that's the best that we can do now. And pretty much that is it. That is how easy it is to add a little uh, text animation onto your videos. You just need to do the screen recording and then qualify it, put put power under around it and then qualify, qualify it. And there you have a nice little animation and you can speed it up in the editing tab by right clicking, go on to uh, change clip speed and then you can just change this to like 200 
Okay, so that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you now know how to make this animation in DaVinci Resolve 15. If you do now know how to make that animation in DaVinci Resolve 15, give this video a thumbs up, and if you're new here and you like what you see, subscribe to my channel because I make more DaVinci Resolve uh, tutorials just like this one, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.